The Ipswich City Council has a quandary how to film a quoll. It believes some of the rare marsupials live in bush at Kimira, but they can definitely be found at Alma Park Zoo. Not quite as rare as hen's teeth, but protected, threatened and described as vulnerable. This is a quoll. They're carnivores, so they're a carnivorous marsupial, uh, closely related to the Tasmanian devil. There are six species, only three left on the mainland. Many have been poisoned by cane toad toxin. So staff were ecstatic when Daddy Quoll began breeding at Alma Park. They mainly are eating insects at the minute and things like mealworms and crickets. Have you got a catch? And no. all that stuff? No, we don't. It all, it all comes. <laughs> <laughs> Lucky for you. Yeah. It started back in August. In that four-month period, the one male quoll mated with three females. The result? 18 joeys. Thank goodness he's not running rampant in the Ipswich bush. There, locals reporting piercing cat-like screams are on a quoll quest after a couple of unconfirmed sightings. Well, we're planning to use infrared cam cameras to determine if they are there. and We're quite wrapped in the fact that they might have been rediscovered around the Ipswich area. Why not? The mayor always says it's a quality place. Anyway, back to Alma Park Zoo, where the Nepalese red pandas are only mildly impressed by the new quolls. And the peacocks are totally nonplussed. The staff, however, love them. They're really, really cuddly. They're really cute. They're quite fun. They run all over you and sit on your knee and sit on your shoulders, climb on your head. Visitors will at least be able to get a photo with the quolls. Mark Sulo, 10 News.